Hi, my name is Juan Pantoja. I'm a professional makeup artist in the Central Florida area. Today we're going to be talking about how to outline the eyes for a nice Halloween cat makeup, eye makeup. Um, this is what we're going for. We're going to have a nice um, almond shaped eye with a little bit of a tear uh, inside on the eye and then a winged out liner. We're going to do it on the other side. We already have a nice look down. It has a nice natural beige color. We're, not, we're going to be focusing on the eyeliner, not the entire eye makeup. So the eye makeup is going to look a little bit more natural. We're going to have some, some natural shades um, that look very nice with the skin color. Because the focus is the eyeliner. Right now we already started with base color, which is a very pale nude color. Then for the crease, we're going to concentrate. I use like a plum, light plum brownish color. We're going to keep it all very sharp. We don't want to add, everything is going to be blended, but this corner here on the bottom, we want to keep it as sharp as possible, just so we don't have to be cleaning up a lot afterwards. It's just going to take longer. I'm going to add a nice, subtle highlight. It's still going to be very pale, very nice skin color, but this color particularly here has some pink in it. It's going to reflect some fun colors. And it works great with that plumish uh, brown that we use on the crease. For the eyeliner, I'm going to use a cream liner or a gel liner uh, with a brush because it's going to give me more control on how to do the liner and how doing the liner. Um, if we like, if we try to do it with a pencil, we're going to have a nice thick liner, and we're going to have to be cleaning a lot more, taking more time, making it perfect. You want to use a brush like this, an angle brush is perfect for this. Some people like to use a thin um, eyeliner brush, but for the type of eye maker we're doing, this brush will guide you through the outline process. So I grab a little bit. You want to grab it mostly on the tip because everything else is going to glide better. Having a cream or gel liner, uh, it stays on all night. It stays on pretty good. Close your eyes. And it helps you outline a color at one point. You can get it very thin or thick. You control it. So the line, I try to keep it as straight as possible. Instead of going like down and up, I go straight to the top and then I blend to the bottom. Let me do it again. From the corner, the outer mark port portion, I go inside in a straight line. When she opens her eyes, you're going to see that curvature of the liner. But when you, it's closed, you're going to see a little bit more straight. We want it a little bit thicker because we want to see that liner. And then from the bottom, we want to try to guide it to open your eyes. We want to try to guide this part towards this bottom part here. Now, a little bit, the little harder part is going to be the liner on the tear duct. It's harder to get into that side there, but we want to start with the tip of the brush, look straight up, and then color it in. Having the angle brush, it keeps because you can just press the brush down and you already have the line. What you have to do next is just fill in, and that's pretty much it. You can stretch that line all the way out as much as you want. But normally, if you want to add more like a cat-like features on your makeup, you want to keep your eyes a little bit more natural. And this is a good way to do an outline for your cat makeup for this Halloween. My name is Juan Pantoja, professional makeup artist in the Central Florida area.